Arabian leopards are predominantly nocturnal, but are sometimes also seen in daylight. They seem to concentrate on small to medium prey species, and usually store carcasses of large prey in caves or lairs but not in trees. Information about ecology and behavior of Arabian leopards in the wild is very limited. Three confirmed separate subpopulations remain on the Arabian Peninsula with fewer than an estimated 200 leopards. The Arabian leopard is threatened by habitat loss, degradation and fragmentation, prey depletion caused by unregulated hunting, trapping for the illegal wildlife trade and retaliatory killing in defense of livestock. The leopard population in Saudi Arabia is affected by the decrease of natural prey species so that leopards increasingly prey on livestock. Local people therefore consider leopards a threat and kill them either by using poison or snares. The leopard population is close to extinction in the country. In 2004, BirdLife International categorized the sociable lapwing as critically endangered, due to a very rapid population decline for poorly understood reasons. The current population was estimated to be between 600 and 1800 mature birds. The population is expected to decline in the next decade or so by 80%, but based on theoretical considerations and the known habitat destruction rather than direct observation of the birds. Thus, the new discoveries might mean that as more data becomes available, the species could be downlisted to endangered. Saigas are known for their extensive migrations across the steppes that allow them to escape natural calamities. They can cover long distances and swim across rivers, but they avoid steep or rugged areas. Today, the populations have again shrunk enormously, as much as 95% in 15 years. The saiga is classified as critically endangered. The horn of the saiga antelope is used in traditional Chinese medicine and can sell for as much as 150 United States dollars. Demand for the horns has wiped out the population in China, where the saiga antelope is a class 1 protected species, and drives poaching and smuggling. They have been a target of hunting since prehistoric ages, when hunting was an essential means to acquire food. Saiga's horns, meat, and skin have commercial value and are exported from Kazakhstan. Agricultural advancement and human settlements have been shrinking habitat areas of the saigas since the 20th century. Occupants limited Saiga's passage to water resources and the winter and summer habitats dot are dependent on weather and affected by climate fluctuations to a great extent due to their migratory nature. Recent trends in climate change lead to increasing aridity of the steppe region, thus, deficiency of the grazing pastureland. An estimate of 14% or more of available pastureland is considered degraded and useless. Consequently, small steppe rivers dry faster, limiting water resources to large lakes and rivers, which are usually populated by human settlements. In the 1980s, several saiga die-offs occurred, and between 2010 and 2014, one occurred every year. The deaths could be linked to calving aggregation, which is when they are most vulnerable. More recent research involving a mass die-off in 2015 indicates warmer weather and attendant humidity caused bacteria common in saiga antelopes to move into the bloodstream and cause hemorrhagic septicemia. The wild Bactrian camel is a critically endangered species of camel living in parts of northern China, only about 1,000 camels still survive. Like its close relative, the domesticated Bactrian camel, it is one of the few mammals able to eat snow to provide itself with liquids in the winter. While the legend that camels store water in their humps is a misconception, they are adapted to conserve water. However, long periods without water will result in a deterioration of the animal's health. Their habitat is in arid plains and hills where water sources are scarce and very little vegetation exists with shrubs as their main food source. These habitats have widely varying temperatures, the summer temperature ranges from 45 degrees Celsius and winter temperature a low of minus 30 degrees Celsius. The main threat is illegal hunting of the camels for their meat. Hunters have been killing the camels by laying land mines in the salt water springs where the camels drink. 
Other threats include scarcity of access to water such as oases, hybridization with domestic Bactrians leading to a concern of a loss of genetically distinct populations, toxic effluent releases from illegal mining, redesignation of wildlife areas as industrial zones, and sharing grazing areas with domestic animals. Due to increasing human populations, wild camels that migrate in search of grazing land may compete for food and water sources with introduced domestic stock and are sometimes shot by farmers. The Gobi bear is a subspecies of the brown bear that is found in the Gobi Desert of Mongolia. It is listed as critically endangered by the Mongolian Red Book of Endangered Species. The population included only around 30 adults in 2009, and is separated by enough distance from other brown bear populations to achieve reproductive isolation. The Himalayan wolf has a thick, woolly fur that is dull earthy brown on the back and tail. Its heart withstands the low oxygen level at high elevations. It has a strong selection for RYR2, a gene that initiates cardiac excitation. Lack of information about its basic ecology in its landscape is an obstacle for developing a conservation plan, but the hunting of the wolf is prohibited. The global population of the snow leopard is estimated to number less than 10,000 mature individuals. It is threatened by poaching and habitat destruction following infrastructural developments. The snow leopard shows several adaptations for living in a cold, mountainous environment. Its small rounded ears help to minimize heat loss. Its broad paws well distribute the body weight for walking on snow and have fur on their undersides to increase the grip on steep and unstable surfaces, it also helps to minimize heat loss. Its long and flexible tail helps to maintain balance in the rocky terrain. Snow leopards are solitary animals, but share a common space. The snow leopard is a carnivore and actively hunts its prey. It is an opportunistic hunter and also eats carrion. Greenhouse gas emissions will likely cause a shift of the treeline in the Himalayas and a shrinking of the alpine zone, which may reduce snow leopard habitat by 30%. The spoon-billed sandpiper feeding style consists of a side-to-side -side movement of the bill as the bird walks forward with its head down. This species nests in June to July on coastal areas in the tundra, choosing locations with grass close to freshwater pools. Spoon-billed sandpipers feed on the moss in tundras, as well as smaller animal species like mosquitoes, flies, beetles, and spiders. At certain points in time, they also feed on marine vertebrates such as shrimp and worms. This bird is critically endangered, with a current population of fewer than 1,000 mature individuals. The main threats to its survival are habitat loss on its breeding grounds and loss of tidal flats through its migratory and wintering range. Siberian cranes are widely dispersed in their breeding areas and are highly territorial. They maintain feeding territories in winter but may form small and loose flocks, and gather closer at their winter roosts. They are very diurnal, feeding almost all throughout the day. When feeding on submerged vegetation, they often immerse their heads entirely underwater. The status of this crane is critical and the world population is estimated to be around 3,200, nearly all of them belonging to the eastern breeding population. Of the 15 crane species, this is one of the most threatened. The wintering site at Poyang in China holds an estimated 98% of the population and is threatened by hydrological changes caused by the Three Gorges Dam and other water development projects. The Amur leopard differs from other leopard subspecies by its thick fur that is pale cream colored, particularly in winter. The Amur leopard is threatened by poaching, poaching of prey species, habitat loss and deforestation or exploitation of forests. Its natural habitat is threatened by forest fires and construction of new roads. Due to the small number of reproducing Amur leopards in the wild, the gene pool is so reduced that the population is at risk from inbreeding depression. In 2015, a wild Amur leopard was found with canine distemper virus in Primorsky Krai. 
the small population is possibly exposed to domestic or wild disease carriers and transmitters. Tigers can eliminate leopards if densities of large and medium-sized prey species are low. In winter, conditions are less favorable for tigers and the extent of trophic niche overlap with that of leopards probably reaches its peak. A number of plans for economic activities in southwest Primory were developed that posed a serious threat to the leopard's survival. A plan to build an oil pipeline from central Siberia through Primory to the coast of the Sea of Japan has been shelved. The Siberian tiger is genetically close to the extinct Caspian tiger. After the dissolution of the Soviet Union, illegal deforestation and bribery of park rangers facilitated poaching of Siberian tigers. Local hunters had access to a formerly sealed off lucrative Chinese market, and this once again put the region's tiger population at risk of extinction. While improvement in the local economy has led to greater resources being invested in conservation efforts, an increase in economic activity has led to an increased rate of development and deforestation. In 2005, there were 393 adult and subadult Siberian tigers in Primory province, with a breeding adult population of about 250 individuals. The population had been stable for more than a decade because of intensive conservation efforts, but partial surveys conducted after 2005 indicate that the Russian tiger population was declining. This woodpecker is critically endangered. It has a single tiny, declining population which is threatened by habitat loss of mature forest due to logging, dam construction, agriculture, military and golf course developments. A major problem now is that one of their main habitats is being destroyed. The current population is estimated at less than 600. This species is suspected to be declining at a rate of 10 to 19 percent over 10 years, as a result of ongoing clearance of old growth forests. The habitat of the Okinawa woodpecker is threatened by the construction of six new American helipads located about 9.5 kilometers southwest of the Yanbaru forest of Takai. The lives of the birds themselves are also put at risk by the flights of ospreys over the island. The Munich spiny rats have a short thick body and dense fur, consisting of fine hairs and coarse, grooved spines. The fur is brownish above and grayish white below with a faint orange tinge. The spines on the animal's back are black throughout while the spines underneath are usually white with a reddish-brown tip. The spines cover the body except for the regions around the mouth, ears, feet and tail. The tail is bi-colored for its entire length. The species is threatened by deforestation, predation by feral cats and introduced mongooses, and competition with introduced black rats. In March 2008, the first wild specimen in over 30 years was caught in the northern part of Okinawa Island. The bone-in flying fox is herbivorous. When eating a piece of fruit, they will suck out the juices and discard the rest instead of consuming it entirely. Bone-in flying foxes are an animal species known to display homosexual behavior, with males observed performing fellatio on other males. This behavior occurs independently of social grooming, and one possible explanation for it is that it promotes colony formation for warmth among males who would otherwise repel each other during competition for females. They are considered endangered because their extent of occurrence is less than 100 square kilometers, their habitat is severely fragmented, and the population is estimated at fewer than 250 mature individuals. In 1969, this species was listed as a natural monument of Japan. This law made it illegal to capture or hunt them.